hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel cook with phyllis where i share easy homemade recipes today i'm going to be showing you how to make a creamy and tasty butter chicken before we begin please don't forget to subscribe down below okay guys so as you can see here i have all my ingredients prepared so I have my chicken here, chicken breast 1 kg, butter, cashew nuts, garlic and ginger paste, salt, onions chopped small, like not very small, tomatoes, like being big chunks, sour yogurt, Then we have our spices over here. So I have black pepper, turmeric, paprika, coriander powder, garam masala, cumin powder, and uh, chili powder. So we are going to start by cutting our, uh, our chicken. So we are going to cut uh, into small cube like sizes you can also cut them in big sizes depending on how you like it but mostly the cube small sizes are much better then we're going to spice it up the secret to a tasty chicken is the seasoning guys so we're going to add in our salt black pepper a teaspoon of paprika some coriander powder a teaspoon of coriander powder chili powder you can add as much as you'd like then I'm going to squeeze in half a lemon So we're going to uh, mix them up. Then we're going to add in our yogurt, three tablespoons. Then we're going to keep it aside for 30 minutes at least to marinate properly. In the meantime, we're going to prepare our sauce. This is where you need to put your whole heart in. So a tablespoon of olive oil, two tablespoons of butter, then add the onions. Cook for three or three to five minutes until uh, the onions is a little bit more cooked. Then we're going to add in our garlic and ginger paste. Turn for two minutes. Then we're going to add in our tomatoes. So this part also, this is where you need to get your spices right as well. So we are going to cook for at least two minutes. Then we are going to add in our spices. So one teaspoon of coriander powder. Half teaspoon of turmeric powder. Then paprika, a teaspoon of paprika, chili powder, then garam masala, cumin powder. And then we're going to cook it and let it simmer for at least 10 minutes on low heat. We're going to add in some salt as well. And a, a tablespoon of butter. 10 minutes later, we will add in our cashew nuts. They are good for protein and also make the sauce thicker. We will cook them for at least two minutes and then we're going to keep the sauce aside to cool off. Then after we're going to blend our sauce. So we're going to blend it to a fine paste. 
I'm going to add in a cup of water because the sauce is a bit thicker. Then blend it and then keep it aside. Okay, so now we are going to pan fry our chicken. We are going to add in a tablespoon of olive oil, then add in the chicken and cook until it's nice and crispy. Our chicken is ready guys, as you can see, nice and crispy. So back to the main agenda. The same pot that we used before is the same pot we are going to use for nutrients purposes. So we are going to add in our paste, let it simmer for at least 2 minutes. Then we are going to add in our chicken. Then we're going to add in two tablespoons of yogurt and stir well, followed by one tablespoon of butter and let it cool off. Then we're going to finish off with adding some chopped coriander for some good tasting and it's ready to serve. I served this with some butter naan which I will be posting the recipe soon so don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button to be notified whenever I post the video. Thank you so much for watching my video and please don't forget also to follow me on Instagram at cook underscore with underscore Phyllis.